What's up everyone? Just do a little introduction here after the fact because I forgot to do it with the GoPro when I set it up. Just got the new Droll at Wood Stove installed with the double wall pipe. A little safer, keep it closer to the wall. We're not gonna burn down, not even that hot to the touch. She's a beauty. Uh, take a look coming up here at the little time lapse I tried. Tell me what you think. And uh, don't forget to smash that subscribe button. All right, guys, so first things first, I cleaned up the uh, existing hole, got ready for some fresh cement, lathered in there nice, hopefully to hold that uh, pipe to chimney conversion in. Threw on some gloves just to uh, smear it around a bit. Then uh, cleaned her up. Next thing, uh, had to get the blower kit. Came with the kit, but didn't come installed. So basically just had to bang out a plate in the back of that stove and, oh, PBR for the boys, anyway. Uh, bang out that plate on the back, a couple screws, and that was really all she took to get that blower motor in. Kind of nice, it's a uh, variable speed, 100 CFM they say. Then, uh, looks like started uh, dry fitting some of these fittings together. It's my first time working with this double wall insulation, double wall pipe I should say. So, a little bit of a learning curve as I went. The uh, piece I ordered, telescoping piece, was 28 to 60 inches and to keep that thing centered was 24 inches so now we're off a little bit but you'll have that on these big jobs bunch of dry fit in here just trying to make it look as good as i could and make the angles right so there's no smoke pouring out of those pieces when she gets hot This is me figuring out that the instructions telling me to put screws in that piece actually meant that I should put screws in that piece, so I had to go out and get some goods. Doing a uh, little pre-drill here incorrectly, you know, first one's always wrong. Then uh, I had to get some more screws, make some more holes, but we got that transition piece sturdy so it wasn't falling out of the hole from the weight of that telescoping pipe. Of course, my faithful companions here, just in the way. Yeah, here we go. Got it looking good. This is me throwing the tech screws in the pipe itself to keep it all connected. Looking pretty good. Overall, I'm pretty happy with the result for our first time dealing with this stuff, but, uh, Gonna definitely need a little touch up paint on the pipe, but they even said the instructions that'll happen. Uh, now I'm off in the corner on the phone, getting my balls busted by a buddy about side work. Shout out to Chucky Edwards. Well, yeah, that's about it. Uh, made this recording probably around four o'clock and it's almost, I think, 10 o'clock now going over it and I'm still burning my first fire with this thing and pretty good.